Over 500 farmers in Torokina are now participating in a program to rehabilitate their abandoned farms. The program is a partnership between the government and World Vision with financial support from the World Bank. Big nurseries, big nurseries in um, five wards in Torokina and then when the the plants are ready to be planted and the farmers work with World Vision, uh, our field staff and uh, the Department of Agriculture and Livestock to plant these new seedlings. The cocoa pot borer devastated the cocoa industry in PNG. In Bougainville, a hundred million kina industry stood no chance to the onslaught of a tiny insect. However, efforts are underway to bring the industry back in the region. Under this program, clones of high-yielding cocoa trees are distributed, along with skills and techniques on how to manage them. There's a difference between the old um, cocoa pods and the current cloned ones. They are, it's more tight and there's more um, seeds inside, so they are bound to get more out of the current um, um, the clones that they are going to be using. Mm. While the project is still in its infancy, farmers are determined and hopeful that Torokina will once again become a major cocoa supplier in the region. Sarah Aupong, National MTV News.